was simply delicious. Yes, guys, it's your life of Vidish, and today we are sponsored by SNS Spices. Spices. What, kind of, what kind of thing we do in there, man? Right? Make it sound so. You know, some of us. Spices. <laughs> Don't worry, guys, we're really sponsored by SNS We did not plan that, guys. Yes, but we're really, really sponsored by SNS Spices today. And they are the Spice Kings of Trinidad Tobago. Yes. As you can see here. Let me check out Kevin, what we have in front of So guys, to the front here, we have some all-purpose. Not here, but here, well, Oh yeah, my <laughs> So guys, we have some anchor masala. We also have some curry powder and some ground jira. Amazing. Check it out. They also come in a soft and that sizes. This is just one of the sizes. Oh, you know that? You want to do that? I don't know. That's the only size. <laughs> Can't be the only size, man. So guys, you know we love to make our videos very fun. And then seeing it, it's you know, a little, little, little boring, boring video, you understand? So, complete seasoning, beautiful. All purpose seasoning. Black pepper. Lemon Amazing. pepper. I'm oh, checking to see everything I get, huh? Italian seasoning. Black seeds. It's looking like Milo from the back. <laughs> Meat. <laughs> it's meaty. <laughs> it's looking like Milo. Ground cinnamon. <laughs> Oh my god, it's like every single thing, oregano. Chili flakes. My god. Time, Kevin and the wife is a nice thing for all this stuff. Um, I feel like I can make something and have all this stuff in my car. What do you think? Like any, so anything. like wherever you go, it's always there. Have this in my car, yeah. a little pot and a little oil. Yeah, I think so. Because I think with all this, we don't need nothing. Yeah. We don't need nothing. So th this sort man, where you, you always have one of everything, so you're always prepared. And we always go in Korea. All the like time. I just have a random quote. It's good to have this. But I think this sponsorship was really for men for me because the amount of powder seasoning. Pasta flakes. Star. Ground ga um, garlic powder. Yes, sir. I will like. And last but not least, rosemary. Rosemary, lovely. I will like. These people are really on our next level, guys. Yeah. They are on our next level. Let me check out this. This is another pasta. Oh, yeah. Wow. This. It's like the ultimate, ultimate spice package, guys. Yes. Well, yeah. mm. The ultimate spice package. I didn't ever see anyone in Trinidad get a better spice package than this. Well, I'm sure we'll have, I'm sure we'll have a couple of the, the same ones. The same that we have. But cinnamon. Fried I think we had cinnamon. Fried chicken. Fried chicken seasoning. More time. I just ran. Oh my God. Chili pick. We got chili pick. Some yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. God. Yeah. Fine. Barbecue. Our favorite thing in the whole world. Oh my god, it's better. Oh, as I just say, Kevin. Paprika. Paprika. <laughs> Oregano. Oh my god, this thing, this thing is crazy. It's really crazy. It's really crazy. Onion powder, garlic powder. Hey, and yeah, you get like three, three, four. Guys, I know that is like Christmas all over again. This is like all spice. Close. Spice. Cool clothes. Spice Christmas, guys. Cool pepper corn. Check it out. You can oh grab. my. Try sorry. And guys, if you don't want the whole clove, you're getting clove and powder form. Church season. More pizza. I don't think anything new. Oh my god. Oh my god. Irish moss. Do you see moss? No, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Moss, yeah, I Irish moss. Check it out. What are we doing with this? We yeah, just figure it out. I don't know. I thought it was salt fish. <laughs> <laughs> guys, we have mustard seeds. <laughs> Check out the variety of stuff these people at SNS Spices have, guys. Amazing. Guys, they are. I just say. Truly, truly amazing. Yeah. Pizza seasoning. But it's a season. I think Cindy will need this. Well, yeah. And for the guys or the ladies who cook it and don't have the original, traditional, what is it kind of origin? Just put Ruku. They get a noto powder. Oh, yeah. I don't know what it's on. Not a Ruku powder. Yeah. So why did they name it Ruku Paula? Yes, I know it's the actual name. Change a little. They get curry, you see each other about different sizes. They get the big size, they get the small size. That curry, guys, I'll try that some other day. Leah, yes. Leah favorite, okay. Cajun season. <laughs> Leah love Cajun season. Yeah, you would not believe, they have all this. And they also have Moringa powder. Healthy stuff, guys, healthy, healthy Moringa stuff. Moringa powder? Who do you want this? You get make and drink. I know there's making and drinking powder. People just cook with it. Yes. Guys, message in the comment if you just cook moringa powder. You can cook with everybody. This is amazing. You put on steak. Mm, amazing. <clears throat> what? <laughs> I try drink, I to drink the moringa once and it wasn't too good. So guys, I didn't even say they're located currently Savannah Road, Charlieville, Shogonas. Their number is 756 
95 tail. Yeah, guys. And trust me, you can get any one of these stuff. They are not. almost all the Chinese groceries in Port of Spain. They also in in Royal Foods, Page. Super quality, all the super quality. All the super quality. Sugars, grocery, Royal. Sugars, Royal. And Page. All plenty, plenty of groceries. Most of the groceries. There are a sugar. lot of groceries throughout China, so check them out nationwide, guys. Call them if you want. They do it. Personal drop offs, deliveries. They cater to everybody's needs. Call the boss. He's a real nice fella. Real nice. Ato, Super nice. Ato Satish. Satish. And his number is 756-9510. Come on, guys. So, this is like. This is like Guys, I even believe how amazing this room smelling right now with yeah, the amount of spice. Real nice. Fennel seeds. Leah, what is fennel seeds? Explain, Leah. Explain the background. You might know. I don't know. I just know it's fennel seeds. <laughs> Guys, we will do some research on it. What is fennel seeds? We seeds. love it. We love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Hey, black pepper. I'm like this. is chicken season. I don't know. I don't My know. favorite thing to use when I'm cooking. Garlic herb spice. I love garlic herb. Cayenne pepper. Complete season. Ground spice. So guys, check it out. Amazing, amazing. This is the ultimate mm -hmm. spice assortment, right? The spice spice hall. himself. Huh? The spice hall. Yeah. Spice hall, whatever. But <laughs> guys, I think all of this, all of this, just listen to this. Yeah. Yeah, that's all of this. They deliver. Easy carry on, carry on. Yeah. You can put it in your car. You can carry it in your purse. Ladies, if you want to carry this anyway, carry it anyway. Now, guys, you're looking amazing, but the main question is it tasting amazing? Yes. And I will Leah coming in. So, we're going to so put Leah, that to the test tonight. Leah, go down, use some of these beautiful season yeah. and make a fabulous dish. So, it goes. Yes. Yeah. SNS. Big up yourself. Spices. We show you goes. In any video, we will know if we recommend, fully recommend. Oh, it's a must. <laughs> <laughs> this is how it goes, guys. Yeah. So, guys, these are the ingredients leader choose to use today. A lot of, a lot of, a lot of ingredients. So, Leah, what are you going to make first today? Okay, so we're going to make some Cajun shrimp fettuccine alfredo. Yeah, have made that before? Yeah, I did. But oh. I don't really use the Cajun too much. I think once I Cajun because oh. it, it's spicy, because the children don't really need spices. Oh, this is my side thing, we are here. Some shrimp. Alright, what are you going on do your thing now, girl? Alright, so we're going on sample some, just plain salt. Alright, some black pepper. <laughs> some black pepper. Black pepper, you want to get some. So, guys, if you ever had Cajun shrimp pasta, try it today. We're going step by step. Remember, it's no ingredients. We don't really I don't measure in here. It's just averaging. We don't work with ingredients. I mean, like, not measurements, guys. We don't work with measurements. Right. The great so cooks don't work with measurements. <laughs> now I say. We're using them Garlic over powder. Nice. All the texture the garlic powder. Nice. It's feeling it's good. fine and nice. and smelling really good. It's smelling good? Mm-hmm. Mm, lovely. Right. So lots of garlic because we love garlic. Yeah, you know, I will, I will point um, out. Onion powder, but I have to look on. Yeah, I'm going to do with our scissors here. So I smell it too. Marisol, studio kitchen, check it out. Not too bad, Christmas tree still up. Right, um, the Cajun season, right? That's right. And I just started show guys. Yeah. Check it out, this is the star. So, you get us an SNS spices, why not? So, okay, that's So, there's lots of this because this is like the star, right? But it is really hot, like I'm a, if you're making, right. if you're making a kids. It's um a little yeah, because I have some cayenne pepper in it. So it'd be a little uh, and pepper spices. So it's a little spicy, but <clears throat> I like it even more spicy, so I'm gonna add some extra cayenne. Extra cayenne. So okay, I guess Cajun is not that spicy because she added cayenne. Well from the one I don't know about this one from, from the ones I tasted before it. That spicy. A little lemon pepper. We just have salt, so you have to be careful. I'm not salty. Guys, and I want to start with lemon pepper. I think it's Kevin who introduced me to lemon pepper. Yes. I think this is a must. Um, that's not true. I used I used to use lemon pepper before. But you never, never <laughs> talk about it. <laughs> no, I never talk about it. No, you know the um the big chicken. I said maybe 
make to me the chicken salad with the celery and stuff. Yes. That's why it's to bake the chicken with. Mm. No. I find a little pop up very nice to season. Okay, so sure. this is a little paprika for some color and flavor. Um, what else? I have to get some this Italian seasoning. Italian. So we're looking for the Italian. Ah, oh, this is Italian seasoning okay. here. So yeah, this pasta you're making. Mm -hmm. Is it sellable? Well, yeah, everybody is sell. No, I mean, compared to what you buy outside. Yeah. You never had a good Cajun. You never bought a good Cajun pasta. Um, yeah, I did. Um, I think somewhere in Shagona, so I had by it. Everyone's? Yeah, yeah, it, yes, was, yes. it was good. It was good. Yeah. But it took yours a good time. But a long time, that was years ago. A long time I didn't know that. That's it for the season, are you sure? But no, yeah. What person doing? What person doing? What person doing? Yeah. The pasta? No, we won't. But that's how you started it, right? I just always use a little person. So, yeah, a little person. And that was a lot of fun. That was a little less salt, so. Yeah. Just a little bit. For, you know, so the um, as we umami always, flavor. As we always say, without vetsin, your food don't have a life. It's only vibrant seed. Yeah, and the thing is, um, oh, it's smelling on it, nice. Yeah, I mean, somebody had a beautiful scene the other day. Um, yeah. that good and bad, that kind of bad, good and bad scene. Yeah. Like, the scene was like, if you eat healthy, you just die healthy. Well, yeah. <laughs> but yeah. But, I'm pass. But guys, Vetson is good for you, trust me. Vetson, better than home salt. It's a better than home salt. I use home salt every single day. I did my research. I just cook with Vetson rather than hot salt. Yeah, and uh, yeah. It actually have less salt content, um, sodium chloride than the um, regular. It was a rumor, and you know, Chinese, we love rumor, and we just went with it. So, guys, you know, all of you use powder season, you must use a couple of your fresh season too. Just chop oh. any onion fine, so because we, we don't have any big chunks of onion in it. Mm, so this one kind of melt down any sauce. So guys, also if you like my pot, this pot was sponsored by the kind sponsor from New York, Infinity. <laughs> also this wooden pot spoon. Thank you again. And that's that's some trademark. That was some bitters. I was just making a um, puncher cream. Yes, we are making some puncher cream and the some bitters fall here and bitters stain. We wash it, it didn't come out. <laughs> Huh, fun fact, we didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> Tastes good, but it stains. Mm. Lovely. We have the pan here. Um, so we have the shrimp already seasoned with all the spices from SNS Spices. All right, so we're gonna let the pan heat up a little bit, and we're gonna add the shrimp first, right? So I'm gonna put a little olive oil. So, big question: You had pasta in a lot of restaurants. You had a lot of uh, pasta or in the streets, Saint James. On the streets. Yeah, all over my pasta, Korean Junction. Uh huh. Yeah. How would you class your pasta compared to the ones you had? Um. I think mine is a 10 on to 10. And you want your boat? <laughs> like 6, 7. <laughs> alright, alright, okay, alright, let's just start it off good. So, guys, we have a little new stove here. Super excited. <coughs> and I'm very, very, very hungry. Looks amazing. Smells amazing. Check out this shrimp, you know, once later. Seasoned shrimp, she's seasoned shrimp. Check it out. Right, so we just wait for the pan to heat up. Uh, and while the pan heating up, let me hear a little bit of your life story. Like when you were small, what you like to eat when you were small? <laughs> you know, it's not somebody that you never used to eat meat. So what do you still like other than meat? Dumpling and tomatoes and saltfish. Serious? That was your favorite food? Favorite food, yeah. Serious? Oh, yeah, yeah, my grandmother used to make that all the time for me. Eh? That macaroni pie. Yeah, pie. but my mother used to make it all the time too. Oh, who understands better? My grandmother. Right. No. <laughs> yeah, hopefully I'll say she grandmother. The thing is, right? When you can't get certain foods again, I think it is always be the best. 
But I just make it and I still don't taste as good as she won. Yeah. It come like it come like snacks. You know like certain snacks that don't have a game. And people just say that was the best snack ever. I don't know why. I could be talking about this. So, you buy not? No, in a minute again. Serious? So, one more minute? Yeah, it's not that hot. I'm not right. feeling any real heat. So let baby to the back of us, watching the phone very quietly. And we see how this goes. Check it out. Now I'll add some of the question. Right, so I put some of the tail for, pres for the presentation after and then some to cook in the pasta itself, right? Woo! That's my red. Amazing. My God. No, I'm going to replace it, that's all I mean. Alright, very good, very good. So guys, message in the comments. You want to think the pasta will taste good? I think you will try the yeah, pasta. I don't know. Let me see the finish part. Wow, that smells delicious. Wow. Sure. Alright, so you should finish, so we're gonna take it off the pan. Just put it in a plate on the side. Alright, put the pan back on. So now I'm just gonna add some white wine, cooking wine. So you get this cooking wine from? Any grocery. Any grocery. Well, Alright, right, just raise the heat, let that cook out. So a just someone who wanna try your pasta and they don't have um, cooking wine. Mm -hmm. What if what if you use? Um, any kind of wine you have, or white wine. Any kind of white wine. Okay. Yeah. All right, nice. So, and the reason for using this white wine is to deglaze the butter. Yeah, right? you could use like if you have like chicken broth, some kind of broth, some kind of stock. But white wine is what the best. Yeah, well, let's give some flavor too. That's why. Mmm. So that is some nice and simple process to make on this charge between 80 to 150 to 200 or so 160 and think for pasta. Yeah, the, well shrimp, yeah, shrimp is be more expensive. Yeah, though. shrimp is not be expensive. The cheapest shrimp pasta might be about between 65 to 85 dollars. Mm. And I think in the restaurant is like a 150. Mm -hmm. But being, it, it is an expensive ingredient, so, but I still feel you can make some money by selling a shrimp pasta for $3. I don't mm -hmm. know why I just say that. Alright, no, I don't think so. Shrimp expensive. Really. I'm not sure if I can tell you what's the shrimp. <laughs> Alright, so I added some butter. Tell me about this one. Um, curry gold, unsalted butter. Mm. Guys, I wish you could smell the aroma in this room. My god. And it's amazing. And that melt, and I'm going in with my onions. Just a little bit. Red onions. And right. garlic. So, one recommendation when you're making pasta is I always say make small portions. It's when you make a big portion of pasta and it get cold, it don't ever taste the same. Yeah, that's true. So, like if you have some people coming next half an hour or next <coughs> hour, make it over for them, trust me. It will take long. If you do everything quick, like how we make our video, mm -hmm. it's a little more time. A little salt. A little time consuming, you know. But you need to eat pasta fresh. Mm, black yeah. pepper. Black pepper, very nice. You go somewhere and buy pasta, don't carry it to so you can't eat it. I'm telling you. You just think about all you have. And? Yeah. Just pasta being yeah, cool. Yeah, cool doesn't taste good, yeah. Tastes horrible. I mean, it's horrible, but it don't taste amazing like when I thought. More butter. Yeah, we love butter. Little less butter yeah. Step by step, guys. And it's a little measurement and thing, yeah? That's true, too. Suit you. Yeah, that's how I just cook. Yeah. Too. Suit what you like. Guys, I'm a good chef to cook. <laughs> I just cook. You guys are chef. Amazing. Everything looks nice, real nice. We got the beautiful spices that we are using right now. Check it out. 
Perfect. Alright, so I'm going to name the cream now. The magic? Right? Yeah. yeah, the cooking cream. That's where the magic will happen, guys. Wow. Cooking cream is one of the best ingredients to make any kind of sauce. What do you think, Leo? Mm -hmm. It is? Mm. Well, for pasta, well, for fettuccine. You know, any kind of sauce here. Yeah. I think well, cooking yeah. cream is a, is a must. They make it turkey sauce, they make it pasta, anything you want. Your biscuit and cream is any cooking cream. Wow. What are you doing, Amos? Alright, so some Italian seasoning. Mmm. -hmm. Very nice. Yeah, this is a must. Yeah, well, I like it. It's got a nice flavor. And a little salt, a little vetson. Oh, Must use the vetson, guys. Daddy. Yes, honey. Oh, that is easy for me just now. And of course, the Cajun seasoning, right? Nice, you must. So, <coughs> if you don't want to use Cajun seasoning, would it be like regular pasta? Yeah, yeah, I don't always use this. You can just use normal. Well, the other stuff that I'm going to add, you will see. Mm. But Cajun is the best. I love Cajun pasta, guys. Check that, my God. Wow. Guys, yeah, you see this? It's what you're making it. You toast some bread. I eat this just with some onion powder. What ingredients feel like good? Mm -hmm, nice. Nice. Well, I mean, it is taste, right? <laughs> and for some more heat, some cayenne pepper. You love cayenne. Make it look this pretty. This is where we'll give it the extra spice. Yeah. Wow. Garlic powder, right? Last thing, garlic powder. So, everything you add, should be added in the back to your sauce. Mm-hmm. Mm. Just now, baby. 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 Just the cheese as yet, so we're going to do the cheese on. Mm -hmm. they, must, this, they must use this cheese parmesan, I could use yeah. regular. Mm, nah, I mean, yeah, you could use regular, but I don't I think might change the taste, same, huh? yeah. Mm. And so that was some powdered one, and this is some fresh one. So it's powder fresh and grated, fresh, yeah. but you, if it is a you one... You can use the powdered one alone, yeah. I just use a blender, I don't have the fresh, so I use a powdered one. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> wow, it looks amazing. But the fresh one always have a better... Um, like flavor. Right. Wow. Check that sauce. Alright, so I think we're ready to add the um the pasta. Alright guys, time for the magic to happen. So the yeah, people don't want to add this type of pasta, they could have any kind of other pasta. Yeah. What other pasta the people is use? Um penny pasta, linguini. Those are the more common ones. And which so one do you add? You add this one? I like fettuccine or linguine. I don't really like penne pasta too much. What? Okay. I don't know what is that, but... That's the kind of cylindrical one. Mmm. Right, so just let this cook down. Because I only cook the macaroni about, um... About, what, 75%. So it needs a little more cooking. So it's very cooking the sauce of that? Yeah, to absorb the flavors, too. So what you're doing is shrimp today, adding a shrimp to the pasta. Yeah. So I know some people add it in and some people just leave it on top. Yeah, well I'm gonna add some in. The ones with all the thing if I can find it. Oh so you add the, the regular ones. Yeah, then. the one that I um, took all the tails from. Mm. Looks and smell amazing. And remember yeah, all this shrimp flavor from yeah. the pot which the glaze already there. Wow. So hungry. Wish you all could smell this. Uh, fresh parsley. And a little um 
fresh tomatoes. Oh my and then God. I'll cook all of it in there. And then we have an onion. And a little extra cheese. More cheese? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if I add much cheese, you know. Right, that should be there. Wow. So let's let us come together and nice up. Now it's time to eat. Let's see how it goes. Oh my god, guys. It's so delicious. Mm. I should this. Taste this. Is it? We finished? Yeah, we're done. Oh, so you're switching on the stove now? Yeah. Alright. So, yeah, guys, you can add there. in all your shrimp. Oh, I did a good layer there. Some parsley. Oh my god. And the tomato. Fresh tomatoes. Guys, question is, will you eat it? Question is, will you eat it? Oh my god. They are look amazing. Only somebody will buy this in a restaurant, boy. And if they buy it, how much will they pay for it? She going again. Oh, Some yeah. extra parmesan cheese on top. Yeah, that's it. That's it, yeah. My word. Guys, will you eat it? Yes, I will. <laughs> yes, guys, Vidish. For the big moment, I actually get the best part of the video to do. And I'm super excited. Check this out, guys. My God, check it out. I think it looks simply. Oh, my. God, I think it looks simply delicious. I want to taste it with all the shrimp. You know, you have to taste the pasta by itself first. If the pasta by itself is good, you know, it's a good pasta. You're not trying to do it like them Italians and them, but mm -hmm. I'm not getting that, right? Maybe it's a rest on the pot. No, I'm not resting on my pot. I love my pot. So, I have a little taste here, guys. I'm going to taste this. Mm. Whole pot is mine. Mmm. Guys, if I tell you, this is the best pasta ever, ever tasted in my life. I don't feel aligned. Guys, this pasta, first time watching my videos, come into the pasta here. Yeah. Videos, I don't want the shrimp, I tell you. Like, I don't care for this shrimp, guys. The pasta is that good, guys. The sauce, my god. Guys, it's also creamy. The spice, the spice just Perfect, not over hot. Guys, I could pay, you see this, this here, I could pay about 250 for this, personally. If I get this portion size with the shrimp. I'll go back with this but before this taste shrimp. Hmm. Hmm. That is why I'm out here. <laughs> that is why I'm out here. See this? I'm going to try the shrimp. I mean, I really wanted the sauce. This one. See this kind of ham? Fork thing I enable. My little sauce, the pearl sauce, my god. Hmm. Take the shrimp now, guys. I'm gonna tell you that pasta guy. Hmm. 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 Just, just bind it all together. Guys, that was the natural knife for the finish. I'm gonna tank. SNS Spices, located in Carney Savannah Road, Charlieville Shogunas. Your number is 756-9510. We think SNS Spices made this pasta good also. Mm -hmm. I think it's yeah, some, definitely. I, it's fresh spices. You can taste the flavor. And I, I think it's some high quality spices. Like yeah. It's a little more texture to the spice. It's not mm -hmm. that fine. We think it's nice. It's really nice. Check them out, guys. Let me take a bite again. I'll take a bite again, guys. Let me see if I get this Italian wrap, eh? God, boy. I need to get it. You wrap, you keep wrapping, you keep wrapping. Let me get this. Girls. It keeps slipping. And maybe I'll hold the full slant. slant. You think they have a different pasta here? Yeah? Hmm? Yeah, I think the pasta is probably a little different. I feel they have a different pasta. And I go, all right, try it, guys. I ain't going through. But, guys. Guys, and we, we all love it. Hmm. Hmm. So 
guy the attempt. Okay, well, she was trying to do the... Well, I get some more than you. Well, yeah, you taste the pasta now. I'll just make it taste the sauce and then make it taste the pasta. This is a little group of guys. Mm. I said that she tasted it. Mm-hmm. Will you impress yourself? Very good. Mm -hmm. could, could it be better? You think you could make it better than that? Probably, but I can't really think of a way right now. Maybe if I think about it some more. But I'm sure everything could improve. No, nah, <laughs> I don't think you can make it better than that again. That is it. Yeah. That is it, guys. Wow. You recording? The speaker thing moving. When you think when we talk? Yeah. Right? Yeah, good afternoon. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Yeah, that's good. Clear and nice. Anything in my face? Huh? Are you looking greasy? Okay. If I wasn't married to you, <laughs> somebody might not marry me. I don't know. Alright. 